Welcome to Tech Drill. In this video, we are going to explore how Pigma MCP server works alongside GitHub Copilot to streamline the UI development process. If you are new to MCP server concepts and want to understand, I recommend checking out our previous video where we covered the basics of MCP. The link is provided in the description. Figma. Figma is a widely used design tool that allows teams to collaboratively design and prototype user interfaces for web applications, mobile applications, and any other software platforms. It is especially popular among product designers and UI UX teams for its real-time collaboration, cloud-based accessibility, and rich design capabilities. With Figma MCP server, you can seamlessly bridge the gap between design and development. It eliminates the manual effort of translating design mockups into code by allowing AI-powered tools like GitHub Copilot to understand the design context directly from Figma. Integrating Figma MCP server with your code editor offers several advantages. First one is faster development. Developers can quickly generate accurate UI components directly from the design. Reduce the errors. It minimizes the misinterpretations that happen when converting design to code. Improve the collaboration. Designers and developers can work more cohesively using a shared design to code workflow. Efficient interactions. Any design changes can quickly reflect in the code through AI-assisted updates. This integration brings tremendous value to developers working on UI-intensive projects. I have a Pigma design of a simple web application. A simple flower next is our application with a, a hero image kind of thing in one side and the description in the other side. Down below we have uh, cards representing the products and a footer information. This is our simple Figma design. Our goal is to generate UI code using GitHub Copilot by integrating it with Figma MCP server. Let us move to the VS code for that purpose. In VS code, we have already configured Figma MCP server under mcp.json. Figma server configuration is using the command npx arguments as Figma developer MCP is the one and the API key input Figma key and the input parameter is defined on top. Now let us go and start the Pigma directly. It asks for the API key, which I have already provided. Let us pass that one. The Pigma server is start running. So we have the Pigma tools available right now. Let us move to the agent mode and refresh the tools available for us now. And going directly into here, it's asking to start the other systems. We don't need the other ones. Let us see what are the tools available. GitHub Copilot chat, let it be there. We don't need the playwright for this purpose and the GitHub MCP server also not required. I just closed that angle, so only pick mice enough. So Pigma provided two tools. One is for getting the Pigma data. The second one is for downloading Pigma images. We are going to use these two tools along with our design. Let us take the URL of the design. So I'm going to Figma and copy the link and asking the agent to design an HTML CSS based web page based on the design at provided the URL 
and download the required images into images folder so if you look at the solution right now we don't have any code pieces only mcp json is there no other code pieces so let us ask the figma mcp server to complete the activities we need to get the data from figma continue it once the design details are there it's going to download the required images from figma and continue the downloading of the images the system created or the copilot agent created an images folder in our solution area and it successfully downloaded all the images there are five six images downloaded already and it's going to create the html and css replicating the design which we are passed copilot agent added the index.html and styles.css two files and start doing the modification the operation is completed let us take the copy of this file copy the path and go back to our browser and provide this one almost it came properly you have the top area and the first portion i'm expecting 50 percentage of the division that is not happened it's uh, captured as the image one side the remaining aspects and all the related products came and the footer not there is some alignment issue especially footer icons are not reflected here the corresponding font it's it may be the font based icon so that's it to upload it otherwise this looks okay images in my cards are not appropriate it's uh, having different sizes so two issues to fix so let me ask the copilot agent again main image on top should be placed in 50 percentage of the web page like the design bottom card images should be of same size these are the two changes i am asking agent to modify the code according to this one the main image needs to be modified and the card images should be of same size right now we have a different card images right coming up its adjustment is completed let us go ahead and refresh the page and see how it's done the main image is 50% uh, covered. It looks fine. And the card images are properly done. If I need three images or three cards in a row, I can specify that. Arrange the cards as three cards in a row. So another modification. The agent is modified the CSS for that let us refresh it now you have this card images but it's coming as rectangular format this is the first iteration now let us do some modification and see whether we can modify our code base according to the changes in our design for example instead of this one i will change the title to new title maybe the color change to some other color red let us do two three changes here also the colors change to some bluish color these are the three changes title changed the color of the buttons changed maybe as placement also we can do it now i am taking the new link let us complete this iteration I have done with this iteration now again taking the agent mode and adding both files HTML and CSS as my context let me go to another model altogether and asking copilot to modify the code based on the design at passing the design 
This time we done a modification on the Figma design and we expect the code modification based on design changes. Let us see how Copilot is identifying the changes and modify the code based on that. Copilot agent identified there is a color schema change, font size or spacing changes are there. The new link become blue colored, title is changed. So these changes are getting impacted right now. Both CSS and HTML is updated. It's looking for any new images available for download. Working on downloading the updated images in case available. In our case, we haven't done any modification. So let us see how the new design looks like. This become blue color. That is one change we done. And the red and new title. This is the new title, red color. These are the changes impacted. And the newly created HTML based web design looks exactly similar to our code base here. This time, if you notice, it's uh, downloaded all the social networking site icons as well and aligned into the footer. The alignment is little different, but it's brought the images and placed it in the footer. So you can create the complete code out of a Figma design. Modify the existing code based on the changes in your design altogether. Integrating Figma MCP server with GitHub Copilot is a game changer for web developers. It accelerates development, improves accuracy, and enhances the collaboration between designers and developers. If you are a developer working on UI projects, this integration is definitely worth trying out. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Tech Drill for more AI powered development insights.